It's it's 10:41. I'm about to get ready and yeah, do some do some mommy makeup. Look who's feeling better. Say hi, Bryson. Say hi, baby. See, so I need to touch up my hair, run the straightener through it, and then we have King just chillaxing. Say I'm just chillaxing, Mama. I'm just chillaxing. People say that anymore? I don't think so. I'm weird. Then we have my Ethan Micah eating his cereal. If you're wondering why I sit King Eric, Bryson, and Ethan at two different tables, it's because Ethan's already been trained to sit down and eat and not get up. And Bryson thinks he can do whatever he wants. So he's at the big table where there's high chairs and he can't get down. So mom tip, want your kids to learn to sit down and eat? Make it to where they can't get down. <laughs> All right, so I just put on some makeup and I recorded it so you guys will see. This is like my mommy makeup look. And now I gotta get Ethan dressed, King dressed, Bryson dressed, and I need to change my pants before Brian comes home and says something. So I actually need to fix our bed and our room's super dark because we have those dark, dark curtains. So yeah, I'm gonna change my pants and get these boys ready because Brian will be here in a little bit to get us. All right. So today has just been one of those days. I just dropped Brian's grandmother and sister off at the doctor. Her sister wasn't feeling too well. And so, yeah, I would have helped, but I have three kids. I'm not trying to sit at the emergency room forever. If anybody knows how the weights are in emergency rooms, especially here in Lubbock, the weights never less than four to five hours ever. I mean, I went to urgent care yesterday and the wait was five hours so that just explains to you guys but yeah there's something definitely going on like everybody's getting sick everybody's not feeling well there's stomach bugs there's obviously strep throat like everything so yeah um i'm headed to my back to my mom's job where i showed you guys yesterday yeah so i'm headed to my mom's job i'm gonna let all the babies see her let her love on her grandbabies and yeah hopefully she'll feed me because i'm hungry and i don't want to go home and cook i'm so tired of cooking yeah, so that is where we are headed right now. It's back to my mama's job. And I should have been in that right lane, and I'm not. So, yeah, I'll see you guys when we get there. Hopefully, if I get food, I'll show you guys what I get from there and whatnot. Any of you guys ever wonder, like, where is Lubbock? Where is it that she lives? It's actually where Texas Tech is, Texas Tech University. And, yeah, so I'm driving to the campus right now um, just to get to the main part of Lubbock but yeah I live where the Texas Tech University campus is I forgot to, I almost forgot to show you guys what we got so Bryson has a little meat and cheese burrito and some fries and then Ethan got a little taco burger and some fries and I got a bean burrito and some cheese fries and a tea because they didn't have all they had is really like Powerade and vitamin water and soda so I got tea yes ma'am Hey guys, so I just got back from the Dollar Tree. After we left my mom's job, I went to the Dollar Tree. And so I got this empty spray bottle. Well, I guess it's, I'm gonna just tell you, this is a little Dollar Tree haul. I got this little spray bottle so I can make my own Febreze. So I'm gonna put like some downy in here to like right here, fill the rest up with water. And yeah, they usually have Febreze, but not this time. And we've been needing a light bulb We've been needing a light bulb for outside for like the longest time. So I finally grabbed a light bulb. And then I got this little two pack of microfiber towels. I like to wash dish. I like to wash dishes with a sponge so that way I can scrub stuff. But these I figured would be better for wiping like my tables down and my counters down instead of going to paper towels like crazy. So yeah, I got that. And then I got a little air freshener because Jack's, like I don't even need to say anything. And then we do have two area rugs, one in our living room and one in the boys room. And Jack stays in the boys room. So I got this pet fresh or fresh pet carpet odor evac eliminator. <laughs> yeah, so I'm gonna just sprinkle a little bit of this down and I'm just trying to keep my house fresh. Like I like having a dog, but I don't like smelling a dog, so yeah anybody else relate to me and then i found these little things there 
called Sure Sense, and I got them because on the back it says it's good for pet odors and like cooking stuff, and like it always smells like cooked food or pets. It obviously in my house, and yeah, that's just something I don't want. So we are going to start with this. Put it on the charger and go lay down. Jacks back up. Then, so I got two of them, one for the boys' room and then one for the living room. And then I cook. I cook all the time, as you guys know, and whatever leftovers we have, that's what Brian takes for lunch. So I've been trying to stock back up on like Tupperware things. And so I have bought a pack for Brian, but one cracked, one has gone missing. And then I sent one home with somebody when I came over to eat. And so, yeah, so I don't know. So I bought two. the three that went that are gone. I bought a three pack of these. <laughs> and then I got a mop, just a little dollar mop. I want a Swiffer as well, which I'll probably buy Thursday as a Swiffer. But this is just because Jax makes a mess with his water. And I need to get him a bigger bowl, but that can wait too. And so we're going to get him a bigger bowl, but he makes a mess with water. So I thought this would be good just to go up behind him and like clean up the water after he's done eating and drinking and stuff. And so that is my Dollar Tree haul. And now I have to tend to Ethan before he drives me insane. Went, in, went on my bottle and wrote Febreze. <laughs> oh, so ghetto. Well, I don't even know where I left off at the last time I talked to you guys. But yeah, I cleaned the house and then I mopped and everything. Like, you can't even tell that a dog lives here. And not that you could tell before, but definitely in the boys' room where Jax is, like, it smelled like dog. And those little dollar things are actually working. Because now I walk in there and like I don't like like I don't smell the scent that it is, but I don't smell Jack's either. And so I was like, oh yes, finally! Like so, I'm so at peace now. Like my OCD is calming back down. I'm not feeling like I have to clean every five minutes or spray something every five minutes just so it'll smell like the spray. I can see my makeup definitely wearing off, but I still look put together, which is awesome. I really want to make this potato soup, but Brian's taking forever, and I knew he would take, hey, and I knew he would take forever because, because he had to go to Brother Gilbert's to get it, and did y'all hear King do that? Love. He just pooped. Love. If I wasn't a good mom, I would leave him there until Brian got home, but who knows when he's coming back since he's at Brother Gilbert's house. So yeah, I'm just sitting here chilling with Bryson and King right here. Ethan's in his room on his tablet, and I just put Jax in his kennel. Yeah, so I'm just waiting for Brian to get back so I can make this potato soup. All right, so I finally finished supper. It is nine. We've been having late dinners these past two nights. I gotta quit. Mmm, this potato soup looks delicious. I will link it in the description box. Can't wait to taste it. What? Just make that sound. Say goodnight. Say bye. bye. bye.